from uh, Kayo. He says uh, XAUUSD is losing the Tenkan Sen uh, Tenkan's minimum. What do you think about the movement? You mean uh, this down Tenkan Sen? You mean? Yeah. So this means that in the short term it's bearish. Simply Tenkan Sen angle means the 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 direction of the short term short term market traders. In this case, short term traders are setting and they are winning. So that's what it means simply. Uh, but in average, um, short term sellers are still losing over mid term sellers because Tenkan Sen is above the Kijun Sen. So I say this is bearish. But uh, the real bearishness happens when Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen, Death Cross happens on the day, day time frame. So again, Tenkan Sen shows the short term, a uh, short term, a uh, short term, like a uh, market level, average uh, price level of the market participants, and Kijun Sen shows the mid-term market participants uh, average price or mean in the market. So Tenkan Sen above Kijun Sen, that means in terms of buyers, short terms winning over the mid-term. But in terms of the sellers, in the short term is still, still losing over the mid-term sellers because again, Tenkan Sen above the Kijun Sen. But so the the average of the short term and mid term changes when they cross. So when Tenkan Kijun Sen dead cross happens in near future, that means the market is really bearish. And if dead cross happens before the breakout of the support, then most likely it breaks. So this is a little bit about a deeper level about the Tenkan Kijun Sen, but I talk more deeply about this in my Ichimo community. So if you want to join, you are more than welcome to join. I hope you enjoyed today's video and in last word, I would like to add this one before ending the video today, and that is Improve step by step every day and never try to be successful tomorrow. Because oftentimes I see some traders come to the forex market or in other markets and they try to be successful as soon as possible. And that motivation is okay, but uh, if you rush to make profits, if you rush to achieve some goal, then uh, you may fail very quickly. Because success only comes based on this continuation of the step-by-step -step effort, step-by-step -step improvement every day. So success does not relate to how much you know about the trades, how much you know about the indicators or the markets. The success only comes from this improvement continuously, step-by-step. -step. So even when you're losing, then look back your trades and look for the areas you can improve your trades and even if it's successful also, look back your own successful trace and try to find an area to improve your trace. Maybe your profit might be a bit too early or your break-even timing might be a too, bit too early too or your stop loss was a bit too tight also. So in both ways, whether it's a losing trace or winning trace, uh, please look back your own trace because that's the only way you can success in the long term. So thank you for watching until the end. If you liked it, please press the like button and I will see you on the next one. So until then, please stay healthy and stay safe and stay gold. Bye for now. Matane. Thank you.